Microsoft OneDrive is a file hosting service that Microsoft operates. And although it's a great tool, you can also experience some problems with it, such as sometimes OneDrive won't start on your PC. But luckily, we might have the possible solution for the problem. To know more about how, follow this next step since video tutorial. So if your OneDrive won't start in Windows 10, there are two possible options that you can try, which is the first one is to check the registry, and the second one is to check the group policy settings. For checking the registry, press the Windows key and the letter R to open the wrong box. Type in regedit, and then click OK. Navigate to HK Local Machine, select Software, choose Policies, select Microsoft, click on Windows, and then choose OneDrive. Make sure that the Disable File Sync NGSC is set to 0. It would also be okay if the registry does not exist. Now another setting to be checked is the Group Policy Settings, and you can start by pressing the Windows key and the letter R to open the run box. Then, type gpedit.msc and then click OK. Navigate to Local Computer Policy, then select Computer Configuration, choose Administrative Templates, select Windows Components, choose OneDrive, and then click on Prevent the Usage of OneDrive for File Storage. Make sure that this setting is set to Not Configured or Disabled. And those are the ways that you can try if your OneDrive won't start or open. If you found this video helpful, kindly like and subscribe. You may also click and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified from whenever we release new videos.